Today's recipe is creamy courgette and spinach soup, or you can call it zucchini if you want to. And without further ado, let's get into it. So for about four or five portions, you need the following ingredients. I've got here four green courgettes. I've got about 150 grams of baby spinach, one small onion and two cloves of garlic, three small potatoes, about 30 grams of unsalted butter. And I've got here 1.5 liter of veg stock. And if you want, you can replace this with chicken. To be honest, you might get even a better flavor if you use chicken, but if you want to keep it vegetarian, obviously this is the best option. With all these ingredients, we've got here some salt and pepper, and now let's start cooking. Set the pan on medium-high heat and go in with the butter. After that, we're gonna chop the onion and the garlic and add them into the pan once the butter is melted. You don't need to go too small when it comes to the onion and the garlic because they will all get blended later on. We're gonna cook the onion and the garlic for about 3-5 minutes or until the onion starts becoming translucent. Just make sure that you mix in every now and then so it doesn't get burned. And now we can move on to the potatoes. And we're gonna just cut them into cubes. Now that the onion became translucent, we can go in with the potatoes. Right after, we're gonna go in with the veg stock. And I'm not gonna add the whole one and a half liters just to make sure that we don't add too much liquid. So we leave probably around 300 ml in here, just in case we need to add more. And we are going in with some seasoning, just the base of the seasoning, because if let's say we need to add later on some more, we can adjust it at the end. And we're adding a quarter of tablespoon of salt and about a quarter of teaspoon of freshly grounded black pepper. Now, get the lid on and from when it starts simmering, giving about 10 to 15 minutes or until the potatoes start breaking apart. Meanwhile, we're gonna prepare the courgettes and it's not a whole lot of work to do here. All we're doing, we're just cutting them in half first. And then just like this, try obviously to cut them in the same size. So they kind of cook in the same time. After about 10 minutes or when the potato starts crumbling slightly, we can go in with the courgettes. Once we added the courgettes in, we're gonna put the lid back on and we're gonna cook these another three, four minutes for when they start simmering. So I've gave my courgettes about five minutes in the end because I have some chunkier ones in there. So now what we're gonna do, we're gonna get in the spinach, but just half of it. The other half, we'll put it once we're blending. Once I've added the spinach, I'm gonna turn off the heat. And now let's get into blending. Before we start blending, I'm gonna get a handful of fresh spinach in. And the reason why I'm adding this is to keep the color of the soup nice and green. Before serving, drizzle with a bit of extra virgin olive oil. And my friends, I really hope that you enjoyed this video. And if you did, I've got another video right here, how to make a creamy kale soup. Check it out and I will see you in the next one. Make sure to subscribe to the channel.